in R80.10 as well as earlier versions of the Checkpoint Security Management platforms, you have the ability to search the rule base for words used in descriptions and objects, as well as IP addresses as shown here. R80.10 introduces a new way of searching the rule base called Packet Mode. Packet Mode enables you to search the rule base as if it were a packet going through the security policy. The search happens on the rule base stored on the management server. It does not require you to pull the configuration from the gateway itself, which makes it quick and effective. Let's start with a simple example. In order to start a search in packet mode within the access control policy, type in mode colon packet in the search bar, or set the packet mode to on at the bottom of the search drop-down menu. Since this mode is treating the search as if a packet is going through the rule base, it will match the results to all the objects and rule settings that is relevant to the search criteria. As an example, we are going to search for an IP address. After enabling the packet mode, we are going to add the source and IP address in the 198.100.25.0 range. Let's take a look at the search results. We can see that one of the results in the source column shows a group object called Corporate LAN. When opening up the group object by double-clicking on it, we can see that the IP address matches an IP address range defined in the object called HRLAN. Going back to the search results, we can see that the rules with any show up as well. This behavior is as expected since the source IP address matches the any statement. In a regular search, these rules would not show up. In another example, we have created a rule to block everyone except HR from accessing Facebook. When doing a packet mode search on the source admin, we can see that the rule with the negated statement, everyone except HR, is included in the results. This shows the power of packet mode, where search is treated like a packet going through the rule base and matches all possible rule settings. Let's look at an example how you can use this feature to troubleshoot problems with the security policy. Someone sitting in the HR department complains that he cannot access social media sites such as Facebook and Twitter. He says that other HR people are allowed, so why not him? Let's see if we can find a rule that would apply to this situation. We know that this person is connected to the HR LAN. We are doing a packet mode search on the source HR LAN, which is going to the internet, knowing that he couldn't get access to social media sites, so we are adding the social networking category, and the action is drop. Running this search shows that there is a rule that does prevent this. So why are others within the HR department able to access these sites? Let's do another packet search with a few different search criteria. In packet mode, select the source to be the HR user object, the destination as the internet, and the application as Facebook, since he mentions that specifically. With this search, we can see that HR users are indeed able to access Facebook and will get a notification doing so, according to the rule. This information gives you more insights as to where to look for the actual issue. In this example, the person having problems accessing social media tools is connected through the HR network, but might not be logged into the HR group. We have shown you the flexibility and the power of packet mode search in RAD.10, which helps you troubleshoot quickly and effectively. Please come back soon for additional videos.